So we need to find all of them. Hmm. Then I think we can continue. Right. Well, it says Swamp Visitor. So I'm guessing we have to go to the swamp. And in case you didn't see that there was a swamp over there, then yeah, we're going over there. So let's go. Um, so with this series I'm going to have it alternating with my survival in case you thought that was ending, it's not, do not worry okay, let's go down here um, I don't really want to go in swamp water but I don't want to waste my boat, so hmm, not the most ideal thing, but it will swamp of whispers Hmm. What exactly is here? Some skull heads. Apart from that, it's nothing really. It's not much else. Alright. Well, let's hop on our boat and go over this way. Because I see a forest over here. And I think it might have something. Alright, let's look. Are we in Jagged Peak? Hmm. Right, so there's the redstone place. Where are we? Are we here? No, we're kind of... Volcanic coastline. Where's the volcano? Is that over here? Let's just check real quick. Actually, I think the volcanic coastline may be somewhere over here. Hmm. Let's continue this way. Alright. I think we. Oh, 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 I miss this. I m completely miss this. Nope, 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 no, nope. I completely miss that little gold pressure plate there. Oh. We need to get that boat. Come here, boat. Right, let's, let's use these lily pads. Oh, we're not allowed to break anything. I don't think lily pads are that big of a deal, to be honest, but... Oh well. <laughs> okay, let's destroy this. There we go. Now we have to ride it back and destroy it again. I completely missed that golden pressure plate. I'm sure you could see it, but I missed it for some reason. Alright. I'm not even going to bother with that, with that boat anymore. <laughs> right. This area is riddled with skeletons. Take extreme cautions. Caution. Not many venture here, and those who do, don't usually return. Hmm. Well then. That is interesting. <laughs> Let's go up here. Right. So, yes, this map series is a trilogy, uh, trilogy, and so it'll be pretty interesting, I hope. We did go into the swamp, but it didn't activate anything on the objectives, so. Alright. Let's eat this. So we got that. We went down there. Then we got that. That's the spider mines. Well, not spider mines, but just the spider area. This isn't cheating. Toggle downfall. Oh. Dang it. This makes sense. Alright. <laughs> Let's turn that down. We're gonna have to deal with the weather. But it makes it more adventurous, I suppose. Okay. Let's look for some gold. 
pressure plates. I think that kind of gives us a little direction on where to go. Or a little heads up on it on where to go. Um, oh! Oh! Okay. Let's go over here. I see a, a couple of houses. Which are quite interesting. We have to see what's over there. Oh! Fields of Mourning. These fields are in the land of unwanted, so because of this they have been given a depressing name. Not much is known about this area. Yet. Okay. There's a golden pressure plate down there that we have to look at and a cave there. You kinda have to look really far in this map just to realize like see what there is. Oh. Okay. We got our ender chest. Let's put all that in there. Okay. So Silas Morrow's residence. This is where Silas Morrow re resided for most of his life except for when he supposedly went back to his homeland even though he was exiled. Ooh. Is this his house? Oh, whoa. Of Calum. Oh, okay. So this is Calum's kind of area. Well, we can get these arrows. I'm going to put this armor on. It's very, very good armor. He, he can have my old iron armor. Right, let's get some mushroom stew. Silas Morrow. I was banished here by the King of Eldridge. I had to survive for many days and nights. There was little to do, little to see, until Caleb, the goddess of air, came to me. She spoke of my death. She spoke of death and destruction in my homeland. I was the only one who could stop the chaos. But I was here. How could I get back home? I definitely didn't want to anger the gods. I had to go back home and stop the chaos. But by then, my family and many of those that I held dear were dead. I have since then returned to this area in which people feel forgotten. Why? Because I feel forgotten. I know my fate is sealed here. Just when it happens is a mystery. Ooh, very interesting. That is a very interesting piece. Hmm. Alright, let's look in here. I think this may be his house. Martha Everwood. Scott. Oh. Um, I really don't want to think what the raw beef is if that's her head. Martha e Everwood. I am Martha Everwood. I seem to be happy when others are crying or in pain. I seem to bring the pain and tears. In response to my life as a tear giver, I have brought myself here. Nobody needs me, nobody wants me. A man named Silas came today. He seems a bit mad and very dangerous. I have tried to, keep, uh, to distance myself from him as much as possible. Occasionally he speaks to me, but in barely audible words. I feel like he has seen a god or goddess, but I couldn't be sure. I have heard that seeing a god or goddess could change your life. I am now regretting coming to this island. Why? Because of Silas. He seems to be getting more unstable lately. For the past couple of days, he's crafted a wooden sword, and he has tons of cobblestone. Why would he need a wood sword? Why does he keep looking at me as he crafts the wood swords? Why is he coming over to me right now? Oh. Jesus. Oh. <laughs> and I'm pretty sure you can tell what the outcome may be. Sheesh. Sorry, Martha. Um... So Silas isn't a good guy. Hmm. What's this? It's a little dark. Oh, we got another boat. Yay! <laughs> I knew it would come back to me. Okay. Alright. So there's, let's go to that golden pressure plate down there. That was a very interesting um thing right there. So we found... We read... Oh. <laughs> we read about Silas Morrow. Yeah. Closed off bay. This bay has been home to numerous shipwrecks. Most not being able to, uh, most have not been able to be salvaged. According to a legend, a simple cargo ship sank here and stayed in de decent condition. Of course, the ship has sailed into this area when the bay was usually connected to the sea. Time has slowly closed the bay off from the sea. Hmm. Usually it would have ero eroded, but <laughs> oh well. Okay. Let's go up here. So, there's a cave down there. But I feel... 
like this mountain may be an option just because of how um, creepy it looks I guess I think those might be air bubbles but they look a bit strange in the distance <laughs> almost fell can we make that? yes okay how do we get up here? Um, oh we can place blocks can't we? we just can't mine them which makes things... T oh this must be the lava coastline okay I'm guessing that's the tallest peak and so we must be able to get up there what's in here? this is a cave obviously I'm not exactly sure where it leads however but it has to lead somewhere I hope probably not I don't know but oh well alright let's go up here it's very dark yeah there doesn't seem to be much here to be honest hmm Go down here. Oh, I heard a cow. Okay. We must be able to get up there. Because that has to be the tallest peak, I'm guessing. But. We just need to kind of find a way. Maybe if we get on top of kind of this little area. Oh, I heard spiders. that's not too good hold on I'm looking if it allows us to break blocks on in any kind of thing nope <laughs> I stay by the rules okay alright let's just go down here this looks like it could possibly be the used cave full of iron and nothing maybe not but yeah there is a hidden chest somewhere and a swamp visitor I thought that was a person but it is a cow it is a cow <laughs> okay oh spider I got it yup this is definitely spider infested hmm sheesh good thing we can just one hit them there's so many okay we got three string let's just uh, continue to the tallest peak oh gosh three it's a good thing our sword is so strong okay gonna get a lot of string oh we can use the string to um to make wool so we can block up okay this looks like the tallest peak but maybe it's here jagged peak no anything aha oh this used to be a very active volcano. Now it merely sputters lava. Okay. Ignis's healing armor. Oh. <gasps> okay. If we put that on, we get extra hearts. Oh. Godly enchantment table. Okay, I'm enchanting. Oh, we need lapis. No! Oh well, we'll just put this on for now. Wait, if we take it off. Okay, it deletes the hearts. Morris Gaunt. Ignis promised to show herself to me today. She was going to give me a gift. She said if anything happened, that the gift would find me. So now I have the gift. The chestplate is amazing. Never before have I felt so alive. There's one problem. 
Where is Ignis? She hasn't talked to me in a while. She has been gone for years. I'm confused beyond all recognition. I must sit on this cliff face and wait for her, if she ever comes. I'm worshipping Ignis because of her loyalty to me. Maybe it's because I used to be an entertainer with fire back in the town of Ethicool. I'm just not sure about anything anymore, though. Hmm. Very interesting. Very interesting indeed. Hmm. That looks something like... Something off in that direction. <gasps> Do you guys see that? That that has to be the hidden chest. Mm. Let's just check in here first. Oh, there's just random case. We don't need these. Okay, we have to slowly get down. Okay. <laughs> oh wait, and then there's something up there as well, and something in there. Okay, let's go swimming. We gotta be quick. Oh, this is where the ship was. This is Okay, we got loads of apples, we got cargo. Let's get this. <laughs> swim, swim, swim. Okay, we're gonna start drowning. Okay. That looks like the hidden chest, but apparently it's not. I'm not too sure, but... Okay. Let's eat this. Um... Not exactly, exactly sure where to go. Okay. Use cave. There we go. We got that. Most likely used as a mine and cave. This cave has lost lots of history. It is likely that more than one inhabitant of this land uses cave. The most recent inhabitant to use this cave. Silas Mar. Hmm. Redstone wand. <laughs> okay. Not exactly sure what that is for, but. Hmm. Okay. I want to see if there's a pressure plate near the chest. Because to me, that looks like the hidden chest, but I'm not sure if they would make it that easy. Oh wait, there's another one down there. Maybe this is it. Or maybe it's in the boat. Maybe. I know you're allowed to place blocks, so yeah. Look, if I do this, then I can breathe. So let's just keep looking around here really can't see much. Oh, my torch. Okay. Um. Okay, that doesn't look like there's anything else down here. Hmm. Let's read Captain Flight. This ship was carrying cargo to some cities in the northern lands. We stumbled upon this land. Up, up on <laughs> this landmass and decided to go and stay a few days. We did, we did need to stock up on a few supplies, so we, we were hoping there would be natives that could help us. We were wrong. Before everything got worse, our ship sank. We ran into Silas, a person that was recently exiled from our city, Eldridge. He tried to kill us and then begged we take him home on our ship, which we explained to him sunk after we hit a sandbar. We were stranded on landmass with a madman. Somehow Silas went missing and then returned a few years later. He was apparently at our homeland and he didn't bring him with us. Uh, us with him, sorry. The only way Silas could have left and returned with such mystery was by a god. Which god or gods were helping Silas? And what secrets are on this island that Silas knows about? He must have access to something. Other than his madness, he seems to always be fine with what he, sa with what he has. Weird. Hmm. Also very interesting. Anyway, I saw a little island over this way. That I'm kind of curious about. Oh. Um, it's borders there. Never mind. Okay. We've explored... Well, we found half of the hidden secrets so far. So we need to continue our search. And we need to find some redstone blocks as well. Because if you can remember, the redstone is um, it's what we need for that. I'm pretty sure that may take us to some, something useful. But I'm not too sure what. Hmm guess we'll have to find out. 
But yeah, let's let's go over this direction. There has to be something over here. Airship hangar, where would that be? Hmm. Oh. What's down here? Nothing. I have a feeling the redstone blocks may be at the golden areas. Just because... I mean, that's just speculation, but... Yeah. Hmm. Doesn't look like there's anything down there. Nothing down there either. 